What do you remember about things here right after the war? After the war? After the, after the war between the states. What do you remember? Most well, Things uh, were hard? Yes, it was hard. They come a fellow through here taking all the horses and everything else you had to plow. Mm-hmm. Who did that? The Union Army? Bunch of, bunch of horse rogues. Mm-hmm. Horse rogues? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They just ride up to the barn and tell you to fetch the horse to them. Mm-hmm. A man by the name of Larry Willis and his crew. Mm-hmm. Where were they from? Oh, they said they said to be in Kentucky. I don't know where they're Kentucky, from. Kentucky, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't know where they're from. Mm-hmm. I uh, don't know. Farm made corn. Mm-hmm. And how long did you do that? Huh? How long did you do that? Farm and work? Mm-hmm. Oh, I done several years. Mm-hmm. And then they began to cut and slay and get all the big poplar timber out of the country. Mm-hmm. I got my three oak cattle and went to logging. Logging? Logging. Mm-hmm. And I logged. I logged down here on what's called Stock Creek. I hope Bill, I uh, all the lumber boys that hope Bill by the railroad from Bristol to Big Stone Yap, they lie on the road by. And Bailey and his successor worked down my 12 months for three old cattle parts at the time and two all the time, myself. You've had a good life. Yes, sir. Worked hard, ways at the mud. Mm-hmm. Struck fellas down by the... Uh, I was working for they just walk in the mud from Kentucky, Captain Banks. He just walk in and up me lift and a big log would get on. His boots were on full of mud and water. The other Jim started walking around with his gloves on blowing his ham. And every check he gave he went to protest. That's the way the world went up. <laughs> Tell me, General. Hello. Do they work? that hard anymore? Huh? Do people... people work that hard anymore? Well, Lord, you ought to want to know. But the times are going to come that they wish you had one. Mm-hmm. If you're going to get there, mm-hmm. they've cut everything.